Hey everyone, this is Annabelle Fig, and welcome back to Pine Hills Farm. Morning cup of coffee. And let's see here. There is, okay, so we finished up that crop order. We got our 2,000 gold. Still need to get some of those lava crabs that were kicking my butt yesterday. Good morning, Miss Annabella. I came by to ask you a favor since you're such a kind neighbor. You see, I'm trying to train my ghosts to say hello, but they simply won't pay attention to me unless I have their favorite treat, cave carrots. So since I'm scared of the mines, I thought, well, maybe you could bring me a cave carrot when you have a chance. There's no pressure, but if you want to, just swing by my house between 9 a.m. and 5 p.m. with a cave carrot. You'll make an old girl very happy. Bye. And Shane's here too. Hey, looking a little better this morning, bud. Oh man, uh, how do I say this? I'm really sorry about what happened at the cliffs. That was embarrassing. Um, I'm just gonna say, I'm just happy you're still here. Wow, it was that serious, huh? I can hardly remember. I've decided I want to see a therapist. Harvey got me in touch with a colleague of his. Anyway, I just wanted to say thank you for taking care of me, and I want you to know that I'm going to take things a little more seriously from now on. I don't want to be a burden on anyone. Alright, let's check our mail. Dear Annabella, I'd like to share a good old cooking recipe from my papa used to make. It's important the fish is fresh. Fish do. Uh, dear neighbor, when I'm not taking care of animals, I like to experiment in the kitchen. Since we've become friends, I'd like to share some recipes with you. Hope you like this one. Pale broth. Okay. Annabella, I have this crazy new idea that I want to involve you in. It's called clothing therapy. Please come to the mayor's house today to see what it's all about. A lot of mail. Uh, Annabella, I want to thank you for taking care of my special orders. All of the hard work you've done has been a great boost to the Pelican Town's image. Here's a mini shipping bin as a token of my appreciation. Place it anywhere and I'll be sure to make a stop when I make my rounds. Cool. Got another one. Just gonna throw that in there for now. Let's put our coffee away. Let's get all these crabs. Okay, let's check our little animals. It's so nice now that they're crowd and they're not all over the place. All these people are petted. Now I'm thinking about doing that home upgrade. We got some pretty good cash flow right now. 
think we can really afford to start doing some stuff here. Um, let's see. Garlic and green beans can go in there. Okay, let's check our greenhouse. Ooh, we got some winter crabs. Plant the winter ones. And get that pomegranate down. Oh, there's a blank spot right there. I kind of want to get a chest in here to put all the seeds or some of the seeds at least um you can go in there corn can go in here otherwise we'll sell off the rest of the stuff Grab that shipping bin. Um, we're gonna do a bunch of things today. Ooh, I'm low on stone. Carrot. There's no timer on that. Okay. We want to hit up the mines. Alright, I'm not going to worry about gifting. So let's hit up Lewis's house. Let's hit up Robin. See if we can get something built. And then we got to get to the mines. There's Lewis. Here we go. Welcome to clothing therapy. You're probably wondering what is clothing therapy. I'll try to explain. So many of us are struggling with personal issues, things holding us back from living how we want. It's important that everyone has a free, happy life so they can so I came up with a new kind of therapy to help people achieve that. It's based on the amazing power of self-expression. Self-expression is a wonderful healing tool. Did you know that? Behind this curtain, you'll find racks and racks of clothes, the endless option to choose from. Your job is simple. Find an outfit that truly speaks to you and put it on. Feel confident in yourself and your choice, and you'll have a unique style to share with the world. Shane, you're up first. Whoop. 
Hey, Annabella, you're just in time. Just observe and keep an eye. Open mind, okay? Oh boy. Shane, it's a new side of you we never knew about. That's great. Now go outside with confidence and show the world. Okay, everyone gets a turn. Oh no. <laughs> Aw, she's cute. She's pretty. Let's see what Demetrius thinks. <laughs> of course. purple hair sticking out or feather or something. Clint, you're up. Go. Okay, Emily, I'll do it. Change out of that apron for once. Oh, the French feel there. Ah, cute. Well, that went very well. I just hope this experience helps everyone break out of their shell a bit. Annabella, um, I couldn't do it. I don't want to break out of my shell. Oh, I, I guess I'm interrupting something here, aren't I? I understand. I'll leave now. Congrats, Annabella. Oh, he thinks I'm getting romantic with Emily. Aw, no, they're gonna be a cute couple. Alright, we don't have time for that. Get up to Robin. Oh, I should just grab the minecart or whatever. I'm already on my way. Alright, Robin, what can you build me? Upgrade my house. 50,000, 150 pieces of hardwood. I don't. How much hardwood do I have? 77. Alright, fair enough. I will need. I did not bring cloth. Seawood, seaweed, and green algae. Maybe today's not the day to get anything. Alright. My bad. I will come prepared next time. Alright, we do need hardwood, so we're gonna have to hit up the secret forest for that. Let's put all this stuff in here. Grab some food. All right, we're gonna start at 100, I think.
I'm just checking out these guys. There's some good stuff down here. Alright, let's just run and grab that ladder. It's a lava crab. Master Slayer goal is complete. Alright, just drop down. So I must have killed enough bats. Oh! Here we go. Dang it. Careful. I only need one more of those guys. Here he is. Done. And I'm running. Alright, leave the food. Take a cave carrot. Alright. 
Annabella, come stand next to the fire pit. Feels great. I was hoping you'd come by sometime. I want to say sorry for mistrusting you at first. Most people don't treat me well, so I learned to be cautious. But you've been uncommonly nice to me. You're a unique person, and I consider you a good friend. Aww. Hey, I wanted to show you something. Come inside. I don't like the sound of that. Ah, uh, there we go. See this? It's a very special kind of fish bait that I make. It's top quality stuff. I eat it myself. Here, I want you to have the recipe. I can make wild bait now. Actually, that is pretty useful, so that's awesome. Um, so my other goal of the day, now I'm not going to be able to see Marnie, it's a little too late, but I'm going to run down to the ocean, and I'm going to put that second box down at the ocean so we can always put forgeables in there. If it lets me. I, I should be able to put it down there. Ooh. Let's see what's on the board. So biome balance. For unknown reason, the local population of riverfish has grown to an unsustainable level. I need a local angler to help reduce their numbers. Or hey, I'm going to invite some friends over to do a rock revel rejuvenation ceremony, but I need some crystals to channel the right energy. Do you think you could let me help? Hmm. Fish or mining? I'm gonna do fishing. Yep, and we already got some forgeables. Now, where do I want to put the shipping bin? Would it let me stick it? There we go. That works well. What are my goals? Okay, yep. Catch 20 river fess. River fish. Well, I got a very small amount of time to kill. So why don't we just see what we can get right now? Smallmouth bass. Thank you. 
All right, let's head back. Actually, let's just see. Okay, yep, we're getting credit. Ooh, I was supposed to talk to Demetrius about those crabs. It's gonna be too late now. Dang it. Oh, wow. We got some resources, so it wasn't a complete waste. I always forget about that. You gotta go talk to the person. Okay, so put that in there. That in Ooh, I should have left the food up there. It's okay. I got stuff everywhere. Okay, we're gonna put the food in here. We can s gift those and we'll get that process later. Save that cave carrot. And I'm gonna use the fish to make food for mining. Oh, it's 1 a.m. Okay, that's plenty of food. I'll put that away in the morning. Everyone, thanks for watching. Catch you in the next one.